well done, you've just got your medal and it was a great swim as well, an Olympic qualification, your thoughts on that race? Oh, I'm just so relieved, you know, I just wanted to be on the team more than anything and, you know, I've come here from, you know, being in Australia for the last well, year and a couple of months and I've just loved swimming again, I've really loved training out there and, you know, I've worked so hard and, you know, yesterday was kind of just get through, you know, the heat and the semi and, you know, focus on what I needed to do today and I did the job and, and I'm on the team, so I'm so happy. I mentioned you've been out in Australia working with Coach Rowan Taylor. Yeah. What kind of things have you been working on technique-wise to kind of push your times back now? Um, just kind of been working on a bit of um, length. Um, I used to break quite high when I used to swim and I just basically do a lot of strokes and so I've tried to back that off a bit and um, be a little bit more powerful and, um, and yeah, just been a bit more efficient really. Do you feel like you're in the best shape of your life or at least best since uh, Beijing maybe? Oh definitely, um, you know in obviously Beijing there was the whole suits, you know the panel blazer suit and all that kind of stuff and you know it's nice to be getting near those times that I was doing um, that year so um, so yeah it's it's just good to be swimming, swimming fast again. Did you come into this meet quite confident after a couple of like untapered 108s uh, in the off season? Um, definitely, you know, swimming those 108s help, um, and have been tra training really well. Um, training times have been going good, and and yeah, I was confident coming in here. Obviously, last night, you know, seeing a couple of the girls going quite quick, I was like, oh, you know, can't let those youngsters beat me. But you know, I just did my thing, my race, and and I did it. So how pleased are you as well to come through kind of the mental test as well, knowing you're the British record holder? And yeah. You're number one in that event to actually see it through. It is difficult, um, you know, it's more difficult coming to this really than it is the Olympics because you just want to be on that team so badly and, and when you're at the Olympics you can kind of relax because you're there and just enjoy it and you know obviously it's, it's still a scary experience but but yeah it, it's, it's difficult because everyone expects you to do it and you know I just did my thing tonight and just kind of forgot about everyone else and, and, and did what I needed to do. Okay, well done, Thanks.